Tech Tips Thursday. Today we're going to talk about shortcuts, uh, specifically on a Mac. Uh, I was asked a lot by our clients um, about shortcuts and what they are and how they work. Uh, first of all, if we get the overview, you will go to um, a little Apple on top and then System Preferences. And under the System Preferences, there's a button called Keyboard. And under there, there's two buttons up here. One is Keyboard and one is Keyboard Shortcuts. And on the Keyboard Shortcuts, you can see all the shortcuts that you can use. For instance, um, if you're looking to make screenshots, let me push this over here real quick, uh, there's a whole bunch of different shortcuts to get cr screenshots directly from your screen. Um, so one is um, to do the uh, entire desktop, that would be uh, Shift Command 3. What I like to use is Shift Command 4. If I press that, Shift Command 4, I will get a little crosshair. And then let's say I want to take this picture here. I can just pull it over with the left click mouse button until I have what I want, let it go. And it will give me a screenshot that looks something like this. So I, what I did here is I made a screenshot of that picture. Very nice to do. Um, there is a whole bunch of screenshots uh, of, <laughs> excuse me, a uh, key shortcuts that are very, very useful. For instance, Command C and Command V. That'll be the copy. So if let's say if I want to take this URL here and want to copy it, I just press Command C, open a new tab, and with Command V, I've just copied it in there. Uh, same thing. It was co Command X will. Um, delete something and um, then with command V you can paste it again. So that will be it for the shortcuts. Uh, have a look. I mean there's a lot of things in here about you know keyboard and text input. Oh and before I forget also in every menu that you have let's say you're in Chrome here up here if you click on file you'll have all the commands here to the right. So a new tab will be command T and your window command N uh, open file, command O, and so forth. So you'll have that all up there in the drop down menus. It'll tell you all about the shortcuts, the keyboard shortcuts. Uh, it's very useful, makes your work very quick and easy. Thank you so much for listening. See you next week.